Okay, welcome to day three. I am here with my awesome son. Hi. Oakley Rock. Oh my, you are so cute. I can't stand it. We are going to pick up where we left off yesterday, page six, 2018. I think the easiest way to do this with your kids is to just ask them the questions and talk through it. So, um, Oakley, what are three good things that happened this year and how did they make you feel? Uh, I went to Costa Rica. Oh, for JJ's 80th? Yeah, that was pretty uh, epic. Why? Epic. Because we were with all the cousins and we were just doing a bunch of fun things and it was basically just chilling out. Okay. What um, else? Performing the musical theater. That was good. Why? Because I got to do what I love the most. Okay. So. And final thing. Um, getting my braces off. Oh. Those Flash were... those white, those pearly whites, man. <clears throat> Look at that smile. I bet that felt liberating. It did. Okay. What are three low points of the year and how did you handle them? Um, three low points were... Oh, going to a new school, um, it's kind of hard to change. Uh, having to get, like, make new friends. Yeah. And having having more work to put in. Oh, with school. Yeah. Most of those are just school. Was it, and it was low because it, why was it low? Oh, wait, and one more is puberty because it made me so moody. <laughs> That's a low point for me, too. Mm. <laughs> Actually, one of my low points this year, other than Amigo dying, yeah. oh. I know, is is how rough of a year you had. Yeah. And watching you struggle. Yeah. That was a low point for me, too, because it made me feel helpless to help you. Mm-hmm. Ooh, let's not stay depressed. Nope. So what was a big lesson you learned this year? The golden rule. Which is what? Treat others the way you want to be treated. Well, technically, I already knew that, but it just kind of, like, came up. A good amount of times this year kind of like that's how lessons are yeah. you already know them but they just tend to get reinforced yeah you know what i mean mm -hmm. um you know what my big lesson was is to be more deliberate that i i still even though i'm 50 complain about things instead of just solving them i let things get to me mm -hmm. i say i want stuff but i'm not deliberate about putting yeah. in the work so that was kind of a big lesson for me, that you can make anything happen when you're deliberate. What did you do last year that you're proud of? I'm trying to think. I think probably moving to a new school and just taking it, like, easy as it can get. So you just rolled with it? Yeah, I tried. You did a good job meeting new people. Yeah. I was really proud of you for that. Mm hmm I thought you did a great job meeting people. Um, what are your hopes and dreams for this year, for 2019? What do you want to see happen in your life? Probably getting closer with the, with the new people at my new school. That's a great one. Mm -hmm. Anything related to musical theater? Probably just to enhance my voice and get better at guitar. I see you picking it up a lot more. Yeah. It's really cool to see that. Um, <clears throat> all right. Um, one thing that I want for me um, I really want, I wrote down, I want my kids to be happy and thriving. All That's right. what I wanted. Pretty good, huh? Thrive. Now that we have, now that Oakley and I have completed 2018, we're going to stop this video. Uh, I want you to do a completion for 2018 by yourself or with somebody that you love and care about. You can go back and forth in conversation. You can do it on your own too. Um, use the hashtag mindset reset. Take a photo of yourself doing it with your friend and post it on social media tag us so we can cheer for you and feature you in our stories tomorrow oakley and i are going to pick back up and we are going to go through 2019 woo, woo, woo! and you're going to show you're going to see me asking oakley about his goals so that so many of you are doing this with your kids and with your students i want to make sure you get uh more video on how you do this with uh the teens and young kids in your life and um, so that's what we're going to do tomorrow. We're going to do 2019. Oakley and I are going to talk through it. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.